John Moody and advocate Gillian Benson are the latest additions to Herman Mashaba's newly formed political party, Action SA. Early last month, Moody announced his resignation from the DA, citing that it was not the party he joined 22 years ago. Moody has now joined Mashaba's party and has been announced as a provincial chairperson in Gauteng. Former ANC MPs Dr. Makosi Koz and Feki Mento are also in the forefront as leaders of the party. We have appointed Dr. Makosi Koza as chair, as the provincial chairperson and head up our campaigns in KwaZulu Natal. <laughs> We've also appointed Vicky Mento as chairperson in the Western Cape. So, yeah. And Mr. John Moody as chairperson here in Gauteng. We will be making further appointments in the coming weeks and months. Ladies and gentlemen, we have emerged for our meeting this weekend, focused and energized on our change to provide South Africans with its first real alternative to the ANC. Moody has described his move to join Action SA as part of developing a new liberation charter for South Africa. I believe you mean this is truly what I call a liberation charter that we have achieved. Yes. Yes. Because that is what it is about. And that is why I am once more enthused, once more reinvigorated to have such good South African patriots willing to start a new life in many instances, being actively involved in liberating South Africa, this beautiful country of ours. Last week, the Independent Electoral Commission rejected Action SA's application for registration because of the use of the South African flag in their logo and a perceived similarity with the logo of the Party of Action. Action SA has accused the IEC of not applying their mind when reaching this conclusion and has given the Commission seven days to respond. This for me was one of the most uh, bizarre kind of query that uh, any normal human being would have received. We actually received the, uh, um, the, the letter from them on Monday late afternoon and I decided to issue uh, to inform South Africans about this because it's not a matter um, to, uh, to really be hidden. You know, because of transparency and integrity I issued a press statement that uh, IEC has taken a decision just so, so send us a cold letter that they are rejecting citing uh, one of the issues being uh, our identity be resembling uh, a party called uh, the uh, POA. The party has deliberated on contesting the local government elections in other provinces and not only in Gauteng. It also plans on contesting the upcoming by-elections on the 11th of November. Natasha Piri, SABC News, Johannesburg.